Welcome to Pure Aqua for the most advanced reverse osmosis, water treatment, and purification systems worldwide. We're at the world headquarters of Pure Aqua Inc. and production completed the fabrication of two seawater reverse osmosis systems going to the country of Saudi Arabia. Uh, the application here is for an industrial water use application and each system produces about 1800 cubic, cubic meters per day for a combined output of a million gallons of treated permeate water. Now included with the shipment we have a total of 16 63 inch multimedia filters. We have pre and post chemical dosing systems which include pre-chlorination, dechlorination, anti-scalant, post pH and post chlorine. Of course, on the feed side, we have our, our duplex feed and backwash pump skids, which we'll show shortly. And lastly is our, our clean in place CIP systems. So starting from the beginning of the process, of course, we will have large storage tanks, we'll, we'll store about an hour operation worth of water. So we begin with a 50 horse duplex 2205 feed and backwash pump, which will pressur pressurize about 750 GPM to about 50 to 60 PSI. Um, on we have a pressure gauge here which ha has uh, a diaphragm seal which will isolate the process from the stainless steel here which will give it extreme corrosion resistance. Now the water gets injected with chlorine chemical which, and then each train gets eight multimedia filters. So we have an A and B train and on the A train we'll have a feed and backwash pump skid, eight multimedia filters, one SWRO train followed by the chemical dosing systems. Um, so what we show here is one train, that's what we're talking about. Now, we have, on our backwash side, we have a very, very similar setup, but without the chlorine injection. A smaller pump, about 25 horse, which will backwash about 350 GPM at around 40 PSI, and that will backwash one filter at a time. So on the SWRO, SWRO side of, of, of this project, we have two skids for each train. We have our high pressure pump skid, which includes the low pressure side of the RO, the five micron cartridge filter, 400 horsepower motor, and a duplex 2205 pump. And then that water gets pressurized and fed into the pressure vessel rack. Um, so kind of quickly starting from the feed side, we have of course our pre and post filter gauges. We have ORP, an ORP sensor, a low pressure switch to protect the high pressure pump, which is actually a, a duplex 2205 pressure switch. And as mentioned, we have our, 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 our high pressure pump. The, the setup here is, is a tur turbocharger setup where we pressurize to about 500 or 600 PSI on the, on the high pressure pump and the energy recovery, which we will show later, which will get us to about 1,000 PSI by recycling or um, recovering um, the majority of the reject pressure back into the feed stream. Um, on the control side of this, we have a Siemens S7-1200 panel, which controls all our chemical dosing systems, feed and backwash pumps our VFD, and of course all, all the automation of the backwash of the filters. And it's all centrally controlled for each train in a, a PLC here. Um, the other panel, which is shown on right to the left of this, is our power distribution panel. Um, and that's the high voltage side of the controls part. So now to talk about the membrane side of, of the process, of course we have our 1000 PSI pressure vessels. These are seven element long to help increase the recovery. Um, we have duplex 2205 stainless steel, which is electro-polished. We have our Hastelloy um, diaphragm seals for, on the high pressure side for the pressure gauges. And as mentioned, we have our energy recovery device here, which was explained previously. Um, we're, we're utilizing Filmtex SW um, membranes here, which give us a, a lower en energy usage and a higher water quality. Um, again, this is going to get shipped out tomorrow to the country of Saudi Arabia for an industrial use application producing a total combined output of a million gallons per day. Thank you.
choosing Pure Aqua 